Hi, Wayne. And uh, in the studio with us this morning, we have Joseph Vaughn, Jim James, and Secret Agent Matt. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Who actually used to be part of the show, so it's good to have you Why, back yes, in the studio. Hello. Remember those days when he would come uh, dressed to the nines in his three-piece suit <laughs> walking around on Main Street? <laughs> <laughs> Did he really do that? Absolutely. Oh, I believe it. For sure, I believe that. Photograph somewhere. He came. He, he would to... come in the studio in the morning in a three-piece suit. Well, not every morning, but he did sometimes. He would just. He would just. I don't even come way. in with makeup sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is that what's going on right now? <laughs> 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 oh, no, no. <laughs> you see, no, I'm the only girl in here now again. Oh. Now it's four against one. Everyone's picking on feed this morning. Bunch um, of bees. So, if you're looking for a great hip hop event. This weekend, guys, Building the Grid is going on Saturday night. Uh, Joseph uh, Vaughn, of course, is uh, the promoter and doing the show here. Uh, Joseph, you're originally from Victoria. Yes, I'm originally from uh, Victoria. Let me get you to step right up to that microphone, guys. You, you can right. just move the mic, but yeah, get, okay. up, get up right on it. And Fee, why don't we push uh, one of the mics so then you guys can share some microphones over okay, there. Okay, cool. You hear me better now? Yeah, absolutely now. Hello, absolutely. Victoria. Well, first of all, let's get, uh, let's get some background here. Um, I know you also go by DJ Versus. Right. That's uh, so I, I had to pick a name, you know, um, as so I did DJ Versus, you know, because I'm representing Versus Productions. And uh, originally from Victoria, grew up here pretty much all my life, moved to Austin about five years ago, had to uh, straighten up, you know what I mean? So uh, left here on bad terms, but I'm coming back in a positive nature, so. Well, I think, you know, um, Joseph, everyone probably has done stuff in the past. That they oh, yeah, regret. definitely. Well, I mean, in a way, you know, I did regret it, you know, but now I feel that... Uh, you've turned your life around. Well, yeah, I mean, I'm glad now that I did. I met... Uh, I had a good start. Whenever I left, I met the Reimers family, and they uh, believed in me and kind of got me a good job with Patterson. And uh, just straighten up. I mean, the hair test will definitely make you straighten up. You know what I mean? <laughs> so started making real money, and uh, and uh, it took a couple years. I was playing with this music, you know, kind of. Always had a passion for music. Oh, definitely, definitely. Since I was a little kid, I used to call my mom, play guitar, and. <laughs> it was like power chords and like maybe like half a scale or something and think yeah i'm a rock star you know what i mean and she's always been my biggest supporter for sure awesome and, and you know i know matt you know who used to be on the show all the time i know matt plays guitar and uh he's done a lot of work in, in studios oh definitely we've done a lot of work too but uh, matt you guys actually weren't y'all at once trying to get a band going when y'all were young i don't know <laughs> don't have a band we were trying to do it when we were in church and here i'm playing nirvana in church. I mean, it was a anything. second baptist church we i think it was to, remember yeah. <laughs> we were just trying to get anything going that's cool yeah that's cool so you guys have a lot of, you guys have a long history together oh Very yeah long, definitely long we're, we're like brothers we fight don't talk for a while then we come back and i mean he's arguably the the better guitar player out, out of this town you know what i mean as far as as far as interpreting i mean improv definitely He's very so, good, very good, very and he'll good. be at the show, just so you know, he'll be performing with me. So, uh, how is that going to work out? So, you're going to be, um, you're going to be throwing down some lyrics, right? Matt's going to be playing the guitar, right? Who's going to be throwing down the beats? Well, I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a pre mix in, in a way. I'm gonna have my turntables there, okay? And, uh, and so we know I'll, DJ Encore is going to be there. Yeah, he's well, going to be there sir. too. Yeah, definitely. But uh, for my set, I'm going to bring my own set, my own tables, just in case. I mean, I like playing live, so awesome. uh, it brings a little more energy whenever you got live turntables, live guitar player. And I'm going to be bringing Shaymar, too. He's going to be featured on the song. And uh, Hype, uh, two guys I was promoting on the last album we just dropped in February, uh, which now, is on I, iTunes. Now, you guys, uh, so you're living in Austin now. And right. I know you sent me some video of some of the parties that you guys are doing in Austin. There's some pretty legitimate parties uh, that you guys are doing there in Austin. So, you know, this is a pretty exciting event for Saturday. Uh, you guys recently did a show in San Antonio. Right, the Revolution Room. And so what you like to do, which I think is a great idea, is when you put on hip-hop shows like this, you have to really use the local talent because right. you've got a following. Right, you got to bring a crowd. Yeah, and so I noticed this show, you have a lot of local talent, and Jim James is one of the uh, local artists yes, that sir. are performing. Yes, sir. So, Jim, give me a little bit about your background, bro. Oh, uh, well, recently I just dropped my mixtape in January, and uh, it turned out real good. We had a show for it at the same location, and... Um, just been rolling with it ever since, you know, and got a call from Joseph, and he, he wanted to do something together, collaborate, and uh, this is the outcome of it. Awesome. I think it's going to be a, a good show. All right, yes, who, who do we have on the lineup for Saturday night? Okay, we got uh, we got Break the Bank ENT. That's going to be Duty's group. Uh, we got Fame. Uh, we have Mike G and um, Big, Game Lamar, yeah, Big Game Entertainment. Yeah, well, we, we got uh, Hype and Crucial and... Um, we also have a couple other artists. Uh, we got the one and only. He's a new guy that I met on Facebook. Hit me up. Said that 
uh, by word of mouth he heard of me. So that is was that pretty cool. Is that how you discover a lot of uh, new talent is Facebook? Oh, uh, um, you know, really, no. I'd say Twitter. Yeah. I mean, really? I, 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 got, I get in touch with more people on Twitter faster than I ever did on Facebook. You know What's what I mean? What's your uh, Twitter name? It's at versus prod, V-E-R-S-U-S. So, uh, you know, maybe we'll put a link or something so that people can start following you. I, I yeah. think it all you guys are on Twitter. Oh, yeah. Okay. I've been on since 2008. <laughs> well, back when it wasn't cool. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I can get a hold of a trophy for you there. Oh, okay. <laughs> You're going to win a prize. You, want, you yeah. want my MySpace URL, too? <laughs> <laughs> to my space is it even still around it was uh, still around right man it's just well, I, I, I still use it wise? yeah i'm sure you do <laughs> well tom sold it which was a smart move and after that i mean you see his facebook post he's like i'm not happy with what they're doing but it is what it is yeah i think he knew it was going down he got out of it you know sinking ship what i've noticed some people have done like some people on their facebook profiles they'll have a little folder that says uh, MySpace picks. So you can click on it. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I looked at pictures MySpace. the other day and I was like, oh my God, I can't believe it. I was 16 years old in these pictures. Uh, all right, so guys, make sure you follow them on Twitter. And of course, uh, you guys are also on Facebook as well. Yes, right, sir. yeah. Uh, so check it out. So it, this show is uh, Saturday night. It's uh, 18 and up. Yeah, so, 18 and up. All right, uh, tickets are how much? It, it's $5 for everyone. It's It's to basically cover the cost and try to. Make a little money to, to promote the next, yeah. Well, I mean, whenever you go to Austin, stuff like that for shows, like $10, 15 20 Absolutely. and you have such a big lineup of, uh, you know, entertainment at yeah, the show. Sure. Uh, sounds really cool. BYOB, guys, 18 and up, $5 cover. Doors at, what, 9? Yeah, yeah 9. 9. The show starts around 11. Okay, yeah. it goes till 2 a.m., so it's going to be... Now, this is at uh, Adelano's Nightclub, which is located right there on the Port it, Lavaca Highway. Yeah, 1705 Port Lavaca Highway. Check it out. So, after this uh, show on Saturday night... Do you guys plan on doing these shows here on a regular basis? Well, I, I guess it'll depend on the crowd, really. You know, yeah. um, I, I wish Ricardo's was open too. You know what I mean? We'd do something there. I mean, me and Elida are good friends, and uh, but you know, right now they're in the middle of building at the new uh, at the Newman's place. So uh, until that's, that's right, done, get that open. Yeah, Absolutely. I've been talking to her about that. But uh, I mean, if, if it goes good, it really depends on on Victoria. You know, well, that's one thing that I didn't think about it. But now that we've gone there. Uh -huh. We should bring up the subject that, you know, there's a lot of people in this city. Right. A lot of people in this town that are big fans of hip-hop music. At one time, Victoria had a hip-hop radio station. Right, 100.9, right? 9, right? Yeah. Which uh, is our station, but now it's, it's a rock, rock station. Yeah. Okay, and so a lot of people, uh, remember the station flipped formats. I know the hip-hop community was, you know, upset with that. Right. But, you know, as with anything, with any business, you know... You guys are not going to keep doing these shows if no one comes out to support the shows. Right. right. Okay, the same thing goes with the radio station. You can't keep a radio station going unless people support the radio station. Right, yeah. right, yeah, definitely. Um, and so, you know, if you guys love hip-hop and you want to see live shows, because, you know, everywhere I go, people come up to me that are, you know, people with the hip-hop community, people that love, uh, you know, hip-hop music, and they're always complaining that there are no shows to go to here in Victoria. There's no clubs right, right. to go to here in yeah. Victoria. So you guys make sure that you go out there and support Building the Grid and check out some awesome talent Saturday because that way you support the show and then there'll be more shows like this. Exactly. Right. I mean, I'll come back. If we, if we yeah. do good on this show, I'll come back. There's no doubt. It's just building the foundation. Yeah, much. it's I mean, really to show me. Depending on the turnout, we'll keep going and going from here on out. But to keep it local, that's why we're trying to start it local. I mean, yeah, absolutely. and we ask everyone to be on their best behavior, please. please. I mean, yes. security, and, and that's a bad that's, rap, too, that, yeah, that Victoria that's gets. That's why. I, I, talk, I talk to other promoters. Let me tell you what, you're absolutely, you hit a nail on the head. That is true. And here's the deal. Whenever we had a hip-hop radio station right. in our organization, we had a lot of people that listened to the radio station and loved the radio station, yet all these people that are in positions like business owners, the people that have the money in the city, the people that love hip hop, and yet they also own a business, would not advertise on the right. radio station. And so, when the radio station is not making any money from advertising, they right. have to actually do come up with a different game plan. Because right. right. you know, you're going to have management that's in another city somewhere, ownership that's like look, just looking at numbers. Right. Mm -hmm. That's definitely. Those numbers coming in, they're like, hey, we got to do something here. Right. You know, we got to you know switch formats. So, I mean, once again, the key is support to anything. So, right. if you love hip hop music. You want to have more of these shows, guys? Uh, go out there and check out Building the Grid, and uh, don't start any trouble. Yeah, <laughs> we, I mean, yeah. security will be enforced. Yeah, they're gonna be there. So. I, I don't really think anyone wants to get tased. You don't want to yeah. see. Uh, I don't want a YouTube man put his guitar down yeah. and go out yeah. to the crowd. Right. Yeah, we'll, we'll have people there definitely, and uh, yeah, they'll be armed. With 
with something. Yeah, I'd hate to YouTube someone getting tased. Security that, won't be provided. Be yeah, it will be provided. And there are going to be a couple undercovers, too. Well, you know, we have a flyer to the event on the KBIC Facebook wall, guys. So if you need more information, you can go to the flyer there. Uh, if people need more information, is there any other place they can go uh, for you can, information? You can go to the Versus Production website. It's uh, versusproductions.com. And uh, that'll have everything on there. And that's anything that we're going to do in the future, too. Exactly. And you can also check out that uh, yacht video that we were talking about earlier. <laughs> oh, that's truly, man. It's awesome. These guys threw this party on a boat. Uh, I'm on a boat. Town Lake. <laughs> <laughs> boats and hoes, baby. Boats and hoes. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was uh, done by Jonathan Lucan. Lucan yeah, Productions. But, I mean, everybody was dressed to the nines. You know, you're on this boat. You're in Austin. You're in the middle of Town Lake. Right. I mean, the boat you were telling me was doing some serious rocking. Oh, yeah. Well, me and Vanessa uh, were sitting there, and all of a sudden played the wobble, and the table fell over. It crashed my hard drive on my computer, ruined one of the cameras. I mean, it was a... It's it was funny a now. It's funny now. But at the time, you know, I had been drinking, too, and I was like, oh, <laughs> no. This is not good. So we had to plug it into our phone and just and just wing it the rest of the way. You know what I mean? It was totally legit, guys. So, yeah, make sure you go to the website, and you can see a link to that uh, video as well. Building the Grid is Saturday night at Atlanta's nightclub on the Port Lavaca Drive. It's going to be an awesome hip-hop show, a lot of local and great entertainment. A big thanks to Joseph Vaughn and, of course, Jim James and Secret Agent Matt for being on the show this Appreciate morning, guys. It. Yes, sir. Thank, Thank you for letting us come. Thank Absolutely. Uh, it is 849. Coming up on the way, we've got more Celebrity Dirt. And remember, guys, we got Flush, the format, at 930 this morning on the show.